my husband was such a good man. Is, is such a good man. Every night he does the dishes, the second he comes home, he's either taking out the garbage or doing yard work, lifting the heavy things that I can't. Everybody in the neighborhood borrows Peck. It's true, women with husbands of their own, men who just don't have Peck's abilities. There's always a knock on our door for a jump start on a cold morning or anyone needs a ride or help shoveling the sidewalk. I look out and there Peck is, without a coat, pitching in. I know I'm lucky. The man works from dawn to dusk and the amount of overtime he does every year. Oh, my poor sister, she sits every Christmas when I come to dinner with the diamonds, her new stole, or the tickets to Bermuda. I know he has troubles and we don't talk about them. I wonder sometimes what happened to him during the war. The men who fought in World War II didn't have rap sessions to talk about their feelings. Men in his generation were expected to be quiet about it and get on with their lives. Sometimes I can feel Peck just fighting against the trouble, whatever's burrowed deeper than the scar tissue, and we don't talk about it. I know he's having a bad spell because he'll come looking for me in the house and just hangs around me until it passes. And I keep my banter light. I'll discuss a new recipe or sales or gossip because I believe domesticity could be bomb for a man when they're lost. And we sit and listen to the piece of the clock ticking in his well-ordered living room until it passes. I'm not a fool. I know what's going on. I wish you could feel how hard Peck fights against it. He's swimming against the tide and what he needs to see is me on the shore believing in him, knowing that I won't give up, that, it, that he won't go under. And I want to say this about my niece. She's a sly one, that one is. She knows exactly what she's doing. She's got Peck twisted around her little finger thinking it's all a big secret. Yet another woman boring my husband until it doesn't suit her anymore. Well, I am counting the days she goes back to school. And she manipulates someone else. And then he'll come back again. And sit with me in the kitchen while I bake. Or beside me on the sofa when I sew in the evenings. I'm a very patient woman. But I like my husband back. I'm counting the days.